Hi, I'm Staff Sergeant Salve Respicio. I am a recruiter for the Recruiting and Retention Battalion. I am married to a service member who is also in the Guam Army National Guard. Uh, we have one daughter and together we enjoy doing jiu-jitsu. Back in April, we competed in the Marianas Pro Japan and uh, it was very nerve-wracking for me competing as a blue belt, um, but together we were able to take home some medals. I enlisted as a 91 Echo, which is a Allied Trade Specialist back in 2011. And immediately after basic training in AIT, I deployed to Afghanistan. So I actually didn't have a job coming home from deployment because of the fact that I enlisted straight out of high school. Um, but because of the opportunities given by the Guam Army National Guard at the time, I was able to pick up a full-time job with them. And from then on, I just been working with the Guam National Guard the whole time. I worked for the medical detachment and eventually landed a GS position with the J1 Casualty Branch Office. Um, after that, I was able to gain two more MOSs, which is a paralegal, 27 Delta, and a human resources specialist, 42 Alpha. Like pretty much joining the Guam National Guard uh, with your specific MOS, it doesn't necessarily mean that you're only going to be stuck with that the whole time. Like me, I was able to gain two more MOSs and depending on your qualifications, you're, you're able to gain more MOSs which will allow you to maneuver in different units. Yeah, so pretty much um, the job that I used to have with the, with the J1 Casualty Branch, I assisted those soldiers who were getting ready for medical retirement, getting out frustrated and everything. And now that I'm a recruiter, um, it allows me to work with civilians firsthand, uh, letting them know about my personal experience and um, just that impact and inspiring them to get in in hopes of bettering their lives. Honestly, as nerve-wracking it, as it is to, to take the ASVAB, uh, talk to a recruiter, just, just do it. You won't lose anything out of it.